Well, this sounds nasty and we like it. A faster, easier, better way to program drums. Drum from Loop Cloud is now available as a standalone plugin and it has a whole bunch of new features. And it can also help you if you're stuck or you find yourself programming the same patterns over and over. Let's take a look at it. Hello everyone, welcome back to Mix Best TV. Hope you're having a great day. Before we start, please check the info box down below for my mixing courses on ProMix Academy, free plugins, special discounts and offers, and of course, links to drums from Loop Cloud. If you haven't already, go watch my artist Bella Kelly's new video, Heartbreak Motel, past half a million views in just a month. You can also win an audience interface just by sharing it. And if you want to support the channel, but most important, if you really want to learn how to mix and master professionally, click the join button down here, become a Mix Plus TV member, access the already big and always growing library of in-depth, start to finish mixing courses, mastering courses in so many different genres, special videos, and you also get mixed consultations with me via Skype or email. Let's get to the video. All right, we've seen this plugin in a previous video, so if you want a full overview and an in-depth how to use it, I'll link the video in the info box down below. Today, we focus on the new features, which are really, really cool, and the fact that Drum is now available as a standalone plugin. is a VST, but I'm using it in Pro Tools through the Black Cat patchwork. And if you're not familiar with the plugin, this is basically an MPC style drum sequencer. We have 16 pads here, all assignable, programmable, and controllable via USB. This is one of the basic kit, is basic kit hip hop pattern two, which comes with the plugin. If I click here in the preset bar, you can see all the starter kits, pop, R&B, hip hop, house, techno, these all come with the plugin. And you can see here at the bottom, it gives you the default assignment for your keyboard pads, stop and patterns. Right next to it, the lock functions. When you change a kit, when you change a preset, you can decide if you wanna lock the pattern, the muter solo, the parameters, the effects, and the samples. But more about this in a minute. First, let's take a look at the new sequencer here at the bottom. In this new version, we have eight patterns and you can chain them using this slider to play them all in a sequence, or you can switch and jump from one to another using your MIDI controller keys from C3 to G3. So you can perform in real time, jumping from one pattern to another. Let's play this basic kit. You can customize and change the patterns for each individual instrument. You have all the tools here right in the main windows. For example, nudge, listen to the hi-hat. You have timing. If you want to add a little bit of groove to it, you have a swing here on the left. You can add triplets and rolls right here from the main interface. So really quick to come with new ideas, fun to use, and if you get stuck, as I was saying at the beginning, you have for each instrument a pattern generator which will generate random pattern for you. That is really cool. If you don't like it, you can clear it. And then probably the coolest feature of this new version, the kit generator. This will allow you to keep your pattern and randomly generate new kits to audition new sounds on the pattern you created. So.
you have two functions that are really important. The first one is the lock tuning. This will keep any melodic elements in tune with the song. If you have a chord, if you have a stab, that will keep everything in key. And the second download content only will make the kits, the new generated kits load faster. And here you have a history. So if you loaded a kit and then you went on and generated a few ones, you can go back to the one that you liked. Downloaded content only because drum is still linked to your loop cloud. So if I click here on the hi-hat, closed hi-hat, you can see my loop cloud, it shows where the hi-hat is. And if I wanna change it, I can keep scrolling here. Let's say I wanna add something, I just write chord and I'll make a chord here. I wanna add, I don't know, a sub sound of some sort, I just click sub here, and it will automatically search into my loop cloud library here. I'm gonna mute this chord right now, I like this sub. All right, this is just to give you guys an idea. And of course you can import your own samples here, simply dragging and dropping. Let's say I wanna change this kick and I don't wanna scroll through all my kicks here. I have a kick that I know I like. Now I'm just gonna pick one random. I'm just gonna go into my loop cloud, open a random folder right now, kick sumo, drag and drop it right here. And that's my new kick. And you can see in my library, I bought a few packs that I, that I found a couple of days ago and I thought were really cool. For example, Trap Axe, and you can see, you can load one that is just kick and snares. This is really cool to select, to have your favorites here. This pack comes with vocals and effects, for example. Full kit for this. And like I said before, when you change uh, a preset, you can lock the samples, you can lock the effects, the parameters, patterns, mute and solo. Effects, we didn't talk about this. We have a new mixer here and we have built-in effects that go on the master. So delay, reverb, crush, drive, filter and limiter. Let me try the crush for example here. The drive, you have transformers or tubes. And you have individual sends. For example, I wanna send a snare to a verb. And you can mix your beat here and export it. Actually, among the new features, we have master output audio export, or you can export your pattern, whether you created or you generated it with the auto generator in MIDI form. So now we have both type of export. If I click on MIDI here, I can drag and drop it literally right there on Pro Tools. And there you have the MIDI and then you can use your sounds or you can use another module if you want. But another cool thing about the mixer is that now we have multiple outputs. So you can see for each one, you can select master two, three, four, up to 16. If you wanna send these individual tracks 
two aux tracks of your DAW and then mix each individual sound using your favorite plugins, all right, in whatever DAW you have. Or if you want, you can record and have the WAV files on your DAW. I got this Down Tempo Cinema here. Something that I didn't mention is when you generate a new kit, if you want, you can keep individual sound. For example, let's say I want to keep this kick, this snare here, right? So I'm locking them and this kick here. And then I can generate, but these three sounds will stay the same. These are all packs that I got a couple of days ago, I really liked them. Next one, stars. So you get the idea, really cool sounds. And we've seen this in the previous uh, video about drum, but for each element, for each instrument, you have a whole bunch of tuning envelope filter. So if you want this sample softer, hold and decay. You have a drive here. Low cut filters, of course, everything sends. Uh, to the delay and reverb if you don't want to switch to the mixer page. And if you want to look up for something new, get inspiration, super easy. Click the preset bar, you open the store, and here you have the Loop Cloud drum, all the packs available. You can scroll through them all or just select the genre, audition it. Let's see, industrial techno, I might find something that I like. I actually like this hybrid grinder pack, so I'm gonna buy it right here. Buy pack, you can see Loop Cloud uses points. So right now I have a little less than 4,000 points. I buy a pack for 50 points, accept, and done. The pack is now in your library, and Loop Cloud also tag all your sounds. So when you go here in your Loop Cloud and search for something, let's type industrial, you will find the new pack you see is already here tagged so you can find all your samples quickly. Well, this sounds nasty and we like it. I'm definitely gonna do something with it and probably next Bella song is gonna be this genre, who knows. Anyway, this is it for this video. This was the new drum, now available in standalone Loop Cloud plugin. I hope the video was useful, I hope you liked it and if you did, please don't forget to leave a like. Leave a comment down below, all the links are gonna be in the info box. Thank you for watching, subscribe if you haven't already. See you next time. Hands on my neck, hands get my throat, throat. Lift me up, up, man, take control Heart is so gone, my tight, don't you know